Here we go! Wow, that's actually really exciting of me. You know I can get that excited. And as you can see, Usopp isn't in the background because we haven't played as him yet. Oh, Zora, why are you getting pissed about? Did they just ask, why are you getting pissed about? It sounds so awkward. I, I meant to say, what are you getting pissed about? But... Oh yeah, you buy quite. In that scene, it just looks like Zoro flexing his muscle. It doesn't look like he's tying on anything. Seriously, it doesn't look like he's doing anything but flexing his own muscles. Oi! Oh, darn you, bro! Oh, you're everywhere! Okay, so, to sum up the story of this, Luffy and Gang go to Alabasta to, to return BB Torque back to the to freedom of the evil warlord, uh, Crocodile. But on the way there, Mr. Three encounters him, and they're gonna have to fight him, and then they get trapped in a casino, and then Sanji is the only one that's not in the casino besides Chopper. And then they take the crocodile after coming out of the casino, and then the story takes over from there, and Sanji sneaks in, and that's all I have to say. Oh yeah, and they introduce Nico Robin. That's all I have to say! Oh yeah, and these are devil food users, so we can't swim. That's why the last time in Drum Island, when I accidentally jumped in the water, he was doing that weird stroke thing. Let's go! After this cutscene. Stupid transponder sales. Oh yeah, I, for, I for almost forgot about it this. And Sanji's alias in this is Mr. Prince. Shut up, Vivi. Shut up! I'm gonna give away his name! I mean, that's seriously, he doesn't have a bounty on his head, but you wanna give away his name? Cool glasses, man. Seriously, those are some pretty cool glasses. Oh, look, Chopper's trying to get by with that phony disguise. Oh, 
So just he gets pissed off and starts yelling at him. Uh, here's where we get introduced to Mr. Three. And he totally sounds way out of line with his American dub. It just sounds like he's a baby. Oh, I love that move. Let's show you it one more time. Dang it. So, Mr. Three is a wax wax man. He's also the boss. And his voice sounds so freaking retarded. I am sorry for the Japanese voice actor, but I think he could have done a lot better with this. Now we're under a time limit, because that's when that's the amount of time we have left till they get drown. And trust me, the water is filling up that cage faster. So let's go! Go yeah! Oh, that was pretty powerful. What's he doing there? SOB! And to be perfectly honest, I never really listened to the Japanese dubs until now, so I would have no idea how Mr. 3 sounded until I heard this game. Oh, that was a nice beatdown, Sanji! Open the freaking cage! Basically, what we're doing right now is 
cleaning up the mess that Crocodile has made and, uh, you know, doing a little cleaning never hurts, as you know. And we're just wasting these guys. And, uh, you know, Alabasta is a dusty desert. The speech for itself is totally self-explanatory. And you're going to be wanting to use your rifle a lot. Because this place is freaking huge. And, oh yeah, something I didn't mention, you guys, your, like, basic normal and heavy attacks, like you do in any fighter. So, triangle is obviously heavy, square is obviously light, and it goes on from there. Now, what we have now are the armored guys, and there are these guys that look stupid, but the armor does work for them. I guess we just found Jabber. Oh, and what these armor guys are supposed to be for is that they're not supposed to flinch. And, uh, oh my gosh, I can't believe I just... Remember to say this, yeah, when Luffy does his special move, the rifle, he's actually uh, using hockey right before. That's what that blue light is. And now we get Marines in on the party. Timer is how much time we have left before the bomb blows. Or how much time we have until we have to face off against Crocodile. General, get in my way again and I'll kill you. Alright, there we go. Nice work, Zoro. You're helping me clean up. This way! Nice work, Jobber! Oh, 
Day of Resurrection! I brought guys over there anyway, so... symbol stands for. Take this! 
was the longest level I have ever played. And now we're gonna fight Crocodile. But seriously, I almost got to level 15 in one level just fighting all these moves. Oh, now Crocodile says that the number on that sand, when that runs out, I'll be dead. And Crocodile is a sand sand man. What that is, is it means that he ate a devil fruit, basically. victory I'm surprised he's alive he like left him there for hours could mean seriously his body looks fine he doesn't have a stab mark anyway Victory. Oh yeah! Excuse me. S ranked. Do 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 do. Can't touch this. Watching, uh, please subscribe, rate, comment, 
And uh Ooh, let me do this. Uh please subscribe, rate, and comment, and I will see you in the next video. So Oh, the silver ones are more. Okay, now I understand. Wait, the silver ones are clients or something? Alright, thanks for watching. See you again next time. Back to Play 100, signing out.